here, your own personal fitness trainer. So today we're going to be using the stability ball and we're going to be doing a workout on the ball for your legs. Yeah, it's a great workout. It's going to offer you a nice variety. So in a moment, I'm going to show you that. Okay, so this is a wide squat, very wide with your feet turned out, and it's with a stability ball, so you have to have the ball against the wall, and you want your mid-back to lower back against the ball, and you want to lean into it, and place your hands like that. You see them wide, and when I'm going down, I'm, I'm holding for approximately a count of 10 seconds. See, I'm holding it for 10, down in that position. And just, uh, we're doing five reps for this one. But test it out first before you try it. Make sure in the right position with the ball. Okay, first exercise is uh, a leg extension, bent leg. So you notice you're sitting on the ball and your hands are on the sides there. And uh, I'm doing one leg at a time. And you can see that I have the leg, I keep it up in the air. In other words, that leg is not touching the floor. And I kick it out. Bring it back in, I kick it out. And uh, you're going for 12 to 15 reps for all these. Okay, now we're going on the other side, same thing, lift the leg up, kick it out, with the flex foot, kick it out. It's going to work your quads, that muscle in your leg. Give it shape and strength. And helping you with balance on the stability ball. Alright, next exercise. Now it's just bent leg lift. So you notice they're staying bent. I'm lifting up off the floor. So each time your foot is touching the floor and I'm alternating. And that is working your quad, but it's also working your hip flexors. Now this one works your hip flexors once again, but this is harder, and it's straight leg, leg lift. So you notice the one leg's bent, that leg is straight with the flex foot, and I raise and lower down to the floor. Raise it, and back down to the floor, raise it. So I'm working the one side, and then the other. And this helps strengthen in your hip flexor. And that is the part right on the upper part of your thigh, the very top, that connects where your pelvis is. All right, you can see it there. Flex foot, lifting it up, raising lower. Trying to keep your balance on the ball by, you know, keep your posture straight. There you go. All right, so this first exercise, it, it's tricky. And uh, it's definitely more intermediate. And uh, you really have to be careful with this one. And I'd say the hardest thing about it is balancing because you're gonna be on one leg. And it was even hard for me because I hadn't done them in a while. So, you see the one leg's on the ball. Now that other leg there, you have to be very careful because what you have to do is your aim here is to learn to control the leg from your hip joint. So when you're doing this, you want to tighten your lower abdominal muscles and you're going to raise your leg 
from the ball about 45 degrees out and you're going to slowly, you want to turn your hip out. You want to turn your leg outward from the hip and you're going to be doing smaller circles. And it's like you're drawing circles in the air, but they're coming from the, your hip. Okay, so for that one, 12 reps. All right, this next exercise is called uh, the bridge with the single knee flex. It's intermediate. And but your arms are always out to the side on the floor for balance. And you notice what I'm doing. I'm drawing my, my foot in. I'm flexing at 90 degrees at the hip and the knee. I'm pulling it in and then placing it back down, alternating. There I'm stretching. Before the next exercise, I'm doing a hamstring stretch with the flex foot. So I want you to do that too, because you're gonna be getting your hamstrings good in the next exercise. So that was a stretch, with the flex foot. Okay, this is a one leg pump. It's tricky. So you see the foot's on the ball. Other leg is up in the air, flexed. So it's the bent leg, it's that hamstring that's getting the workout. And I do touch the floor. I go down and touch the floor and I pump it back up. Right there on the hamstring. It's tricky with the balance. And you see, it might look like that ball is against the refrigerator, but it's not. So it's tricky not having the ball, you're balancing that ball. Doing the same thing on the other leg, pumping up. Um, you know, if you're having a hard time doing it and you want to initially try it with the ball up against something, that's fine. But uh, it does take away from the exercise. But if you just want to check it out that way, that'd be fine. I'd say for this, 12 reps. All right, there you have it. 